In this video, I'm gonna be talking about leptin resistance. How do you know if you have it, and then what can you do to improve it? Leptin can be measured with a blood test, and optimal levels for most people are under 10. So when leptin levels get above the 20s, the 30s, and even the 40s and above, this means that the body is becoming increasingly resistant to leptin. These are some of the things that have been shown to help with leptin resistance. One thing I wanted to mention is that people with leptin resistance also oftentimes have thyroid problems. And when they get their thyroid checked, their thyroid labs may appear normal. So TSH, free T3, and free T4 may appear normal. However, they need to be testing their reverse T3. And this is sort of like the brake pedal for the thyroid. So reverse T3 levels are oftentimes elevated in people with leptin resistance. And this needs to be checked out and addressed. If you found value in this video, follow me for more hormone optimization tips.